Hey, it's Basic Sorgonomics, and I got most of my voice back. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. As we record this here early in the week, and my, my, my whispers, my pained whispers of the weekend. Oof. Need some more lemon tea. Anyways, I'm talking about talking, talking about conversing a little bit, spending some uh, some time around the city. I end up, I end up gravitating towards those those coffee shops, those places of caffeinated uh, commerce around the city. Whether it be a Starbucks, I got a card, got to get my stars, or or what I like to do with you know, I have my smattering of local establishments uh, that I, I'd like to support. But I can't go to a new coffee shop because new coffee shops scare me a little bit. It's about the vibe. It's a little bit about the vibe. I feel like I'm invading somebody's hipster territory. But uh, anyways, so I'm sitting there. I'm in Ed Brew on Broadway, a wonderful place. Community coffee shop here in Beachview. uh, An area that I've started um, investing a lot of my brainwaves towards lately. Um, really kind of uh, looking at what what can happen here uh, because there is so much and it's kind of invigorated my thoughts on this is not just the place where I happen to have a house and I'll move away sometime. Uh, maybe we stick around for a bit and we can do something cool here, right? Uh, that starting, that startup mind in my head is that, that made me want to do something different with myself several years ago. It says, what can we do here? And I'm at Baru. And uh, and I'm seeing you know there's a guy there's a guy that's been coming in that, that I by chance encounter uh, uh, started talking with and we might have some really interesting stuff working out and I'm watching that happen like he's in there and, and, and talking with somebody else new and I see other people coming in and I'm seeing the community people that know each other and and I've kind of shied away from that a little bit you know or at least I talk to the baristas you know uh, quasi regularly right but I'm usually in there to kind of uh, have a vibe. And, and work around that and, and mostly keep to myself. But I'm, I'm, I'm watching it and I realized how important it was for us to have this community coffee shop because where else would people go um, if you weren't a church goer, right? And everybody goes to different churches. If you weren't this, if you, you didn't go to these things, if you didn't go to the huddle. I've never been to the huddle. Apparently that's a place to be up here. <laughs> Steak salad or something. I don't know. Um, but I, I think that's the biggest sin of uh, as a beach viewian. I have been here for eight years. And I haven't been to the huddle, I guess. But anyways, um, but I'm looking around and just realizing how vital this just this coffee shop is um, as a place where people can congregate. You know, not a I'm going to go and have pizza with my friends down a slice on Broadway. Sponsor of Tuesday Night Podcast. Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> They don't even pay me for a sponsorship. I just mentioned them for the hell of it, even if we didn't, they didn't give us stuff. I, I seriously would still be, and we'd probably be ordering from there every week too. Um, but but thank you. Uh, but but you know stuff like that. You know, and and how people you know come in and they're chance encountering people, and you're learning about what's going on in the community and how that's working out. And and I think that's really really cool. And 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 I started connecting that with. You know, we, you know, we're, we're, we're using these other platforms and we're trying to, I know for me, I'm trying to create the home that is like some community around the website.com itself and not so dependent on other places. But a lot of times you do need to go to the Reddit where people are, the Facebook group where, where your audience is, the, 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 the Twitter hashtags where your, your viewers are, are paying attention to that show everybody's watching. And you need to go to those community hotspots, just like you need to go to the coffee shop. I'm watching a couple of people in there and, and, and I know they have, you know, motivations, you know, you know, building something motivations, community building motivations, community changing motivations. And I'm watching that going to the place where the people are, the coffee shop. And I want to say, take my podcast, take my pro wrestling podcast. And I want to, Bring the conversation where it's happening and integrate it into that Facebook group or Google Plus community where those conversations are happening, that Reddit community where those conversations are happening. Be, go in, integrate, be part of that community. Genuinely, genuinely, they will smell you. They will smell the stink on you if you're just there to sell shit, okay? Just like if you're just there to shill in the middle of a coffee shop. You're that annoying guy with the business cards, and I try not to be that dude. You know, uh, it's it, it's it's that kind of thing. You know, or or that authenticity. But 
immersing yourself in the community. And again, I, I, we say that so much when we talk about social media. But when I say community, I want you to visualize that coffee shop. That's not a freaking Starbucks. Okay, I guess it could be a freaking Starbucks because the people come in there, right? And you run into people and 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 have chance encounters and and have your meetings there and everything and 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 everything and 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 that, yeah, okay, that happens, that happens. But for the purity of this, let's just think of brew on Broadway. <laughs> let's think of a common common uh, commonplace coffee. Let's think of uh, Orbis Cafe in Mount Lebanon. Um, um, th these are the places I end up. Um, Zeke's Coffee over in East Liberty, for instance. So, um, so every time I say, you go to a Facebook group and invest in that community, you're sitting down, you're buying a coffee, you're observing the stuff going on, you're sitting there with your laptop or your iPad, and you're reading the news and seeing what's going on, and maybe checking out the artwork on the walls from a local artist, maybe picking up the flyer of, oh, hey, there's a farmer's market down here, right? The farmer's market, maybe you picking up the flyer and checking out the podcast of somebody else that's on there saying, hey, we talked to some about something cool over here, right? Use that metaphor when you're out there. You're like, okay, you know, I, I you know, <laughs> Although Reddit is kind of the coffee shop that if you talk about yourself too much, they'll lock the door. <laughs> I think about it. Uh, but, but, but the metaphor works, right? You don't want to anger the community and have them coming at you with the uh, pitchforks or, or throwing hot coffee in their lap. So work with that. Your community is a coffee place. How does that work together? Um, see if that helps you when you're kind of thinking about how to reach out there. And, and maybe your attitude when you're reaching out there as well and your, how you're developing maybe that content that you want to say, hey, guys, go look at this, you know, that flyer. That content is kind of that flyer in that business card or the, or the, or the, or the, or the, start, the conversation starter a little bit. So I'm still working on this metaphor, so let me know how it goes. Maybe I'll write a blog post when this formulates entirety. Let me know what you think. Um, and let me know how do how do you integrate in your local coffee shop? Are you just a are you a lurker, a creepy guy? This coffee, his laptop. I didn't really talking to anybody. Nobody knows what that is on his laptop. It's like an editing program, Final Cut Pro X, and he, and he had his goofy stuff like hobo videos and pro wrestling. Nobody understands. It. See you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.